The owners of Fulton BBQ held another soft opening for their business tonight. Their new location in downtown Corpus Christi saw a line on the sidewalk waiting to give it a try. This is the second soft opening after their first one just a week ago. And our Brandon Schaff was there to meet the owners and see what everyone's so hyped about. He joins us now in studio. Brandon, was it finger licking good? <laughs> yes, it was. Yes, it was. Oh, you caught me off guard there. That was good. Well, this uh, first soft opening saw lots of success for this new restaurant, and the owners tell me that a line was wrapped around the corner, and they sold out in three hours last Saturday with around 300 orders last time. Well, they hope to replicate that success again tonight. It, it was a blessing. Um, I, I couldn't believe it. But, you know, when you have good food, they will come. Co-owner Andrew Pena started Full Send Barbecue in 2020. To overcome the challenges of the COVID-19 pandemic, he said he turned to social media to help promote the business. After moving around to different locations, they're now building a permanent location on Taylor Street with the help of a business partner. I believe this is the first outdoor uh, barbecue place, you know, and we're kind of bringing like Austin vibes to, to downtown. Pena smokes the briskets while co-owner Desiree Hill makes homemade sides. She said the sides are influenced by traditional southern food and her Puerto Rican background. Since the venue is outside, Pena said weather is a factor they're working to overcome. They said they are providing water to everyone waiting in line and have plans to provide shade as they continue to build. Hill said she was happy to see how many people came last weekend. We had the line all the way to Mesquite Street. It was great. I know it's super hot and I'm, we're just super grateful that people like came out to be a part of it. There are currently pit masters in training and Pena said they want to bring a new generation of barbecue to Corpus Christi. Danny Ingersoll and his wife Carolyn were the first ones in line for the second soft opening on Saturday. He said he's known Desiree for years. She's had countless barbecues in my backyard. Now it's time for us to turn the favor and try her barbecue. They both said they think new business there will be good for the community. I think it'll be good for downtown. And Pena says that he's targeting mid-September for their grand opening. They plan to add more turf, an upstairs area, live music, and more. And until then, they will have soft openings like that one every Saturday, eventually opening Thursday through Sunday from 11 a.m. until they sell out. And if the food looks like that, I'm sure that'll happen quite a bit. All right, Lexus, back to you.